one of the claimant's uh, key concerns over the years has been that in the international fora, considerable number of, of uh, uh, work has been done uh, without due consultation with Māori. So the Crown goes into these international fora uh, speaking for Diwi Māori. Um, we're pleased to see that the Tribunal has recognised uh, that issue and has recommended that where the Crown enters into international instruments that directly bear on the kaitiaki interest, then Māori should be there at the table in partnership with the Crown. And that's a significant move forward in terms of the current operations of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs and Trade. They see Māori as being consultees. Uh, if this recommendation is taken to its uh, full potential, then we would see Māori and the Crown sitting at the same table representing uh, the views of uh, Diwi Whānui. So, next step and what's needed? Well, next step is a sleep. <laughs> uh, what's needed, I think, is, and we've talked about it at the hui, is a sense of kotahitanga amongst Fano and Hapu about these issues, so that we are working together to inform each other about the potential. Uh, we then went, want to send the tono very quickly to the Crown that it's time to engage uh, in a considered manner on these issues that have been proposed by the Tribunal, uh, and we're looking forward to that. Um, but over the, in the short term, we've got to read this report in some detail and provide advice to these claimants as to how, how best to go, go forward from here.